programming guide for the CodeLocks 5000 electronic lock. The CodeLocks 5000 lock has a 12 button keypad including the star and pound buttons. Two LED lights are located at the top of each lock. A blue light indicates that the code has been accepted. A red light indicates that the code has been rejected. A red light will flash five times to indicate low battery power. Batteries should be changed as soon as this happens. A brand new CodeLocks 5000 lock comes with a master code that is preset by the factory. The master code controls all programming functions. The factory's master code should be changed to your personal master code immediately after installation for security purposes. There are 15 different functions, each with a two-digit program code ranging from 01 to 15 that allow you to change the functions of this lock. A listing of these can be found in the Programming and Operating Instructions booklet or online. Programming this lock requires each step to be entered within 5 seconds. Incorrect use of this lock or mistakes made while programming will cause a red light to flash and beep. After a 5 second time out, restart programming. Programming this lock using program code 10. How to change the factory's preset master code to your personal master code. The factory's preset master code is pound, one, two, three, four. Note, the master code must always start with the pound symbol. Choose your personal master code prior to programming. Length of your personal master code may be four, five, or six digits long. Important, during the initial setup, the digit length of your personal master code must be entered as part of the programming function. Reminder, write down your new master code and store in a secure location. Let's demonstrate how the codes should be entered for program code 10. Pound 1234 is the factory's preset master code. 10 is the two digit program code. This changes the master code. 4 is the length of the personal master code being used in this example. Reminder your personal master code may be 4, 5, or 6 digits long. 2900 is the personal master code. Note this code is only being used as an example. 4. Re-enter the length of personal master code being used in this example. 2900. Re-enter personal master code that is being used in this example. Let's begin our video demonstration using our 4 digit personal master code example 2900. Step 1. Enter the factory's preset master code pound one, two, three, four. Blue light will flash once, indicating the code has been accepted. Step two, enter program code one, zero. Blue light will flash once, indicating the code has been accepted. Step three, enter length of personal master code four, followed by your personal master code two, nine, zero, zero. Blue light will flash once, indicating the code has been accepted. Step 4. Re-enter the length of personal master code 4, followed by your personal master code 2900. Blue light will flash twice, indicating the code has been accepted. Now let's change the factory's preset master code. Step 1. Enter the factory's preset master code pound. One, two, three, four. Step two, enter program code one, zero. Step three, enter length of personal master code four, followed by your personal master code two, nine, zero, zero. Step four, re-enter the length of personal master code four, followed by your new personal master code two, nine, zero, zero. 
To verify the personal master code has been successfully programmed, enter your new personal master code. The latch will retract and a blue light will flash to indicate the code has been accepted. In this example, our new personal master code is pound 2900. A blue light will flash and the latch will retract. The factory's preset master code is no longer pound 1234. The latch will not retract and a red light will flash indicating the code was rejected. In this example, the preset master code is no longer pound one, two, three, four. The red light will flash and the latch will not retract. For technical support, contact us at 714-979-2900 or sales at codelocks.us. Our regular business hours are Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time.